This is KTVO's Good Morning Heartland. And a welcome back. Looking for a show that's out of this world? Well, Truman State University's Planetarium may have the thing just for you. Jerry Young is here this morning to tell us more about their themed laser light show taking place right now. How are you doing today? Doing pretty good. Living the dream. Well, thank you so much for coming up uh, this early in the morning to come on the show to Not talk about the planetarium. Now, before we actually talk about the featured show that you have this month, let's go ahead and talk about the planetarium because a lot of people might not be familiar with it. Yeah, uh, the planetarium was actually built back in 2005 as mm -hmm. part of the Magruder Hall or Science Hall uh, renovation, mm -hmm. um, but it stayed empty until just a couple of years ago when enough donation money had come in to finish it. Mm -hmm. um, so grand opening in October of 2014 and then mm -hmm. uh, a series of committees worked mm -hmm. to try to determine what to do and how to implement programs and activities within the planetarium. Um, from that I uh, took the opportunity, I uh, got to hire a few student workers mm -hmm. and uh, since then we've been providing public shows on Saturdays. We're open for reservations. Mm -hmm. um, we do star shows predominantly. We, mm -hmm. we have the ability to drive through the solar system as if we were in our own spaceship, able to travel through space and time. We can talk about anything from constellations to different characteristics of planets, mm -hmm. get to talk about Mars recently since mm -hmm. it's been in the news, uh, Jupiter as well, things yeah. like that. So now let's go ahead, I mean I actually got to go there a couple days ago and I got to see the inside and I got a sneak peek of uh, you took me to the different planets which I thought was really cool. Mm -hmm. uh, you took me to uh, Saturn and told me about uh, the ring around it and right, that yeah. each molecule is about the size of an F-16? Or F-150, yeah, every, every, yeah. Uh, everything yeah. in there, average size of a truck. Yeah, is a so I thought particles. that was really interesting. So, and I was only there for about 10 minutes, so I can't even imagine being there for the whole entire uh, presentation. Now, what we're seeing on our screen right now is the actual laser show. So tell us more about how that all works, because it's actually uh, tuned up to themed music, correct? That's right. Uh, we got the idea from actually a Truman alum, Patrick Hess, who works at the planetarium in Kansas City. He mm -hmm. does uh, laser light shows, and we were kind of taking notes from what he does at his planetarium. And so we rented this system from a group called Sky Laser, AV Imagineering. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's running from October 8th through October 22nd, and mm -hmm. the music is queued up to laser lights, so it goes with the beat of the music. Mm -hmm. um, depending on the show, our Beatles show, for instance, has uh, pictures of the Beatles or mm -hmm. of the singers. Uh, we have a pop music show with NSYNC, so you have the boy band oh, up on there yeah. that are dancing around. <laughs> Um, so, so, and most of them last between 30 and 40 minutes. Mm -hmm. So it's uh, it's it's a really fun, really immersive environment. We turn up the music. We've got a great sound system. Mm -hmm. um, so it's it's a good time. And uh, is this the first year you're doing this with yeah. the laser show? Yeah, this is the first year. This is our first go at it. Okay. Um, it's and been successful enough right now that we're looking at potentially bringing it back in the winter time. Um, there's a series of laser holiday shows. So, oh, well, that'll be fantastic. So if you want to see Frosty and uh, yeah. and Rudolph up on the up on the dome. Yeah, you know. and something you know fun and festive to do when it's so cold outside because you get to come indoors. Yeah, yeah, come indoors. Yeah. So how much does something like this cost if anybody is interested in going to see a show? Uh, it's $5 a ticket uh, mm -hmm. this year for no matter what it is, no mm -hmm. matter what show, um, it's $5 a ticket. On Saturdays we've been doing double features of a, of a planetarium show and mm -hmm. a laser show and that's still just $5 a ticket. Um, for field trips it's uh, $25 an hour. So okay. if you bring your class for an hour it's $25 and that, that's total. That's uh, it. Alright, so what we'll do to make it easier for everyone that might be interested whether it's seeing the show or you know a class field trip or anything like that is we'll post everything on our website at ktvo.com we'll link up information with the planetarium phone number website all you need to know in order to get in contact anything else you'd like to add uh yeah no if you want to get tickets tickets are available online and at the door so you can go to planetarium.truman.edu there's a little description of each show so you know what you're going to before you get there um, and 5.30 and 7.30 through this week in the evening time. Uh -huh. uh, special homecoming times, but like I said, check out the website. Uh, right. We got some cool stuff. Perfect. Well, thank you so much, Jared, for coming on. Thanks for having me. Appreciate and it. We'll be right back.